here at the PBR Feature Games with Eli Dickey from Christ Presbyterian in Tennessee. Just pitched his first inning here. Uh, how did things go? How did you feel like the event went for you? I think I went good. I had a small sample size and only nine pitches, but I showed them a good curveball and a couple fastballs in there for strikes and had an efficient inning. You got up to 88.9, you said, on the fastball? Yeah, 88.9. Yes, you got sir. a strikeout. Uh, how did you mentally prepare for this? Because you know there are this, this, the scouts are back there. Everybody knows what this environment's like, but how did you kind of prepare yourself for it? Well, I just like, it's just like every other start, just go out there have fun be loose um, don't let the scouts like tense you up to take you out of your game that's how I kind of prepare a top 10 player in Tennessee in your class if you had to self scout as a pitcher mm -hmm. how would you do it um, I would just honestly pitch ability over velo I mean the velo will always come but if I had to scout pitching, I would just go pitch ability. Can he throw two or three pitches for strikes and command a zone with uh, some pretty good velo? That's how I would scout the pitchers. Rank the secondary stuff for me. What, what, what do you feel like is working really well for you right now? Um, probably the curveball. I can throw it a lot for strikes. I can throw it for a strikeout down in the zone to get people chasing. I'd say curveball and then my secondary probably I'll go slider, throw a hard slider. That's uh, for strikeout pitches, and curveballs for usually strikes. Do you have a favorite out pitch? Is it? I mean, is it that curve? Do you, do you, do you like, you like getting the guys get the knees buckling a little bit on that curveball? Uh, yes, sir. It's either the curve or like a high fastball and just try to rip it up there high in the zone. Uh, obviously, your dad, Ari Dickey, a Cy Young Award winner, was a pitching coach for at CPA with you. How's that dynamic worked with the two of you in terms of you being a developing pitcher and trying to write your own path? Well, I just just don't worry about like living in the shadow. I just we're just here to get better, and he's a good asset to lean on. And it's always cool having your dad out there on the field, and especially I just try to listen to him and take what he says and try to apply it to the game. And everybody wants to know if you can throw a knuckleball. Yeah, I get that question a lot actually, but I no, I do not. My my hands are actually too big. In fact, uh, he has me throwing like a ch uh, four seam changeup instead. Of the knuckleball. If we had this conversation a year from now, I'm always interested in what a pitcher thinks. This is the thing that'll take me to where I want to be. What is that thing for you? Um, definitely just like pitch ability over velo because I know I mean, if I keep working, I'm going to throw harder and harder each year, just learning how to throw strikes and that's what I would work on throughout for a year from now, maybe touch like 92, 93 next year and show for strikes and a good secondary pitch. All right, I've got a ball. I, I love Perfect. to have guys show me their grip, so I'm having you take us through what you work. Sound good? Yes, sir. So this is how I hold my fastball. I grip it kind of close with my fingers on the seams and try to roll it up the seams and my other fastball is my two seam I go right here and try to make it come off this finger so I can get that downward inward action um, another pitch is my curveball kind of choke up on this seam right here try to pronate it straight down like a 12-6 and my slider I uh, just move my two fingers over here and try to rotate that uh, lateral action on it through the zone and then my four seam change up I go two fingers on this seam and circle change and I try to do my dad always told me right pocket stay through it and not try to cut it off like a cutter just right pocket right down the middle and I aim right at the catcher's mask Eli, man, thank you so much for doing that. Yeah, I appreciate no the problem. time. If you're not already, make sure you follow 8 Point Sports on all our social media channels. Hit that subscribe button on YouTube. You'll get so many more of the athletes that come here to show out.